are in boxing contracts with certain uh, leagues and organizations and all the fighters that I would like to fight are UFC fighters and they're all in uh, contract with UFC. I'm the only free one out here. So <coughs> they're the real baddest motherfucker. I could fight anybody. Nobody could fight me. Mm-hmm. And uh, he's the highest level of competition, the best fighter that was able to box. And uh, that's what I'm taking. Not the best of the best. I ain't, I'm not. I ain't fighting no punks. Never, forever, forever find the best. Like uh, purple and puns. Uh... Already forever had been too. For since I had five fights in UFC uh, after the Ultimate Fighter that were that were under a, uh, above a top ten ranked opponent. Then I demanded uh, top ten top ten guys, and I've been fighting them. Or 25, 30 fights in the UFC, and now whatever I'm doing, I'm finding, finding the best fighter that can fight. I'm not going to play fight. I can fight anybody for $10 million, and probably, I can probably fight anybody and probably get $10 million. I'm, I want to fight the best of the best or the biggest. Everyone thinks Jake Paul is the asshole, but so why am I going to not fight him? You know what I'm saying? So I'll take the best in the room always. Nate, it's 2004. Uh, since 2004. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, uh, not really. I don't think he's very good, very, very good, or that big. <laughs> like I said, everybody believes Jay Paul's the biggest best thing happening. Uh, and Fury, I guess maybe he'll be an option at some point, but right now our times ain't timing, baby. I don't think it's my time for that time. Nate, Charlie Quinn from Fight Sports here. Um, obviously, happy birthday first and foremost. What's kept you around the game, around the game so long? Uh, probably just. That's all I do. I train to fight, and it's, I've been living in the war life since a little kid. I've been fighting my whole growing up, and um, I think uh, for one, that's it. I already accepted that a long time ago, and I'm a long distance runner. You know what I'm saying? Like the rest of these fighters. Then Gaethje just got slept the other day, right? By yeah, by yeah. Holloway got yeah, picked his boys and went to the yeah. Fight. He was just it. came into the UFC in two thousand. I've been in the UFC since two thousand seven. Yeah. He got in the UFC in 2019, I believe. Yep. You know how much I'd done before he got there? And then they asked him about me, and he started making fun of me, talking about how I'm a journeyman and, uh, and how. Uh, and then his boy was the champion, and then when the whole BMF sh- came on, he was f- making fun of it. They were clowning the BMF title and, yeah. and boycotting it and all this stuff. And then him and Usman both got knocked the f- out, and they're on their way out, and they're gone, long gone already. And they just got here, so... Uh, you were like 17, 18, fighting pronouns. Yeah, I was fighting the whole time, so, like, the disrespect for even saying my name, like, that is crazy. And uh, I was here before all of the UFC fighters. I'll be here long after. And uh, I'm a long-distance runner, baby. I'll be here to the end of time. And just, like, what does it mean for you to, to headline a card like this? Your name first and headlining a big boxing event like this? Yeah, that's the way it should be. I feel like I'm the greatest fighter at all in all, all the sports, but just like I said about these guys, even the championship holders, Usman and uh, Woodley and all these guys, they're like, um, they're like, uh, they're, they're on, congrats, they're great fighters and all that, but they're, they're, they're on top for f- five minutes, five title fights. Title holders f- fight top five, top ten fighters, right, as they're defending the belt, and then they, they defend it four or five times. And uh, then they get put to sleep, and then they have a couple rough fights, and they're out the out the careers. But uh, I've had rough fights the whole time. Never got the belt, but been fighting top ten fighters, top five fighters for 25, 30 fights. I fought better fighters than all the people. So if that answers the question, it does. It does. And after this, are you going to continue boxing, or are you going to go back to MMA? What's what's your plan? I'm going to do both. If I have to go back into the UFC to uh, to fight those guys. Uh, that, that are the best in the world, then I will. But uh, if not, they get their ass out here and fight me. And then if not, I'm going to try to fight the best boxer that the box too after this. So, but like I said, Todd, the best of the best in both sports is my plan for the next 20 years. All right, thanks, everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.